What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Tony and your girl Nikki, and we are back with another video right now. We're actually headed to the mall to film another video for you guys today. But in the on the way there, we wanted to sit down and tell you where have we been because we know we've been gone for maybe about two weeks now. Honestly, Has it been two weeks? I feel like it's been two weeks. And forgive me if it goes bright and whatever because we, you know, driving we're driving right now and we're on our vlogging camera. But um, yeah, man, do you want to start it off, babe? Why? Well, basically, we have company over the house for about a week and i've been working and then on top of that you know just rushing entertaining we could have vlogged all yeah that. we could have no honestly excuse. vlogged well I, I stated earlier that we could have vlogged all that but we were kind of just living in the moment yes. and enjoying our company yeah. bull and anna came through also brandon we also had my boy d of uh d money everybody was coming through to the house yeah. the whole entire weekend yeah and it was anna's birthday so we were yeah. all like celebrating and also sneaker con Atlanta. Sneaker con. so it was just a lot of festivities going on and it was just our minds were like everywhere minus exactly walking. yeah i mean so really it just we were just tending to our company and we were kind of just fully occupied throughout the whole time and, and nicole has uh, another like side gig on her hands she works basically like from the morning to about like six so sometimes it gets a little bit harder but we, we're gonna be able to get videos out more and more and we have a big surprise we can save the surprise for next week what we're actually doing you know yeah. what, what's going on but we have a big surprise coming up um I would, this week next not this week coming up this week we're in but the week after so we'll say that till probably the end of the week to also, tell you it's my birthday mom so yeah november 19th yeah. nicole's birthday make sure you follow her on i nikki gomez yeah. on that as well and uh you already know what it is so we're on our way to stone crest though and we'll be shooting a video over there yeah our first mall vlog i know that's been requested yes so we're gonna so, be doing that be doing that as well updates on the house the house has been going really well we're about, actually about to do a pre-drywall walkthrough pretty soon on yeah, that it's building really fast really really fast like the house is fully framed it's fully framed and wrapped and it has windows and our bathtubs are in there so the next thing for them to do is throw insulation and then drywall on the walls start painting and then start putting cabinets yeah, so and stuff right now we're like in, we're searching for a home inspector yes so we're because yeah Oh shit. Did it crack it? No, it sounded like it wanted to. Uh -huh. But yeah, so right now we're looking for a home inspector because we don't want to use this to builder. Like they're gonna be of course they're gonna say everything's perfect. We need that third party person to go in, check and see. If you guys got any uh like price range wise, if you had a new construction, let me know how much you guys had to pay for home inspection. I found a guy who do the pre-drywall walkthrough and then the final inspection for together for $600. Nicole, her uh, mom referred us to somebody and they wanted to do $800, but they had it was all these- like $850. $850 and they had- a free $500 package. This, yeah, they, this lady <laughs> this was- This lady was like trying to sell yeah, it. Yeah, she was trying to sell it, but um, it sounded good. But let me know if you guys surprised, you know, what's good, what you guys think is too much, too less. We're in, we're in Atlanta, of course, so. You know, maybe if you're in the West, it may be more expensive or whatever. So just let us know that down below. But that's been that. Um, one other thing that's kind of changed with the house also, though, is that our closing date got pushed back to February 10th due to a couple things. We were in a whole dilemma where basically I had to decide whether or not to go with my lender or the preferred lender of the home. And my lender, uh, he wanted to go FAH. And I didn't want to go FH. He told me to go FAH to get approved. And then later on, we can switch FHA, my bank, FAH, I don't know, FHA. He told me to go FHA to get approved. And then later on, we can switch it over to conditional, which I didn't like the sound of that. It sounded kind of like, well, why can't we get it approved now? Why We can't get it approved now, but you know, how can we get it approved later, whatever. So I was like, ah, you know, I've been kind of off the wall with him. The lender though, however, preferred lender said that they can get us approved However, they want to use only my last year's tax returns. And in order to do that, my business has to be five years old. And the f fifth year of my business will be February 14th. Um, and, you know, the one thing, though, here, and, and this also would be conventional as well. Uh, the only thing that really made me want to jump with that was, one, you know, we get like $5,000 for uh, closing costs. And we don't have to come as much. We basically have to come with, like, uh, around. Oh, shit, I was supposed to get gas. Um, there's more gas stations up there. I like Chevron. Oh my. Well, Chevron's up there. I know, but I wanted to go that one. Oh, okay. Well, um, yeah, we had to pay around, another, I think around another like $7,000 added that we used the, my lender 
versus their preferred lender and the interest rates are all the same a lot of stuff is all the same so i'm paying attention to a lot of that stuff honestly too i know that's something to pay attention to but um yeah man i mean one thing for certain fha i'm not trying to have that pmi for the rest of my life that is something that's also new when it comes to loans that if you do fha they just changed it to where you have uh pmi for the life of the loan and yes i could refinance in here however interest rates are going to most likely go up there's things to consider there but that's been that with the house but pretty much everything's good the house should be done late december early january we'll have to just wait a month that's enough time for me to stack my money the other thing is also the fact that there's a delay and it's the preferred lender with the delay i don't have to like pay any like extra fees for that it's there it's on them not on me so yeah that's been that um the house and uh what else anything else the diet's been going well mm -hmm. um so far i'm at about i've lost about eight pounds nicole where are you at i lost six pounds six it's been pretty tough can't lie i have a lot of sugar moments we had our first like cheat meal this uh past weekend also during the whole festivities and i know you know thanksgiving's yeah, we're coming up to have a cheat meal too. yeah so thanksgiving's coming up soon too so you know it is what it is but i i am um at, currently at 167 I'm trying to get down to 160 by the end of this thing next actually this week this week my bad this week we have to actually go shopping on sunday yeah, this week is detox, is detox week so once again we're going through hell part two uh no solids this is well snacks kale chips and shit like that yeah so i'm not looking forward to that but uh we gotta do what we gotta do i'm looking forward to losing a lot of weight again this week though because like, i don't know i know yeah, a lot of times we, we lost mostly. yeah we lost weight but we i didn't gained it back that's either. that's that's the thing usually people will say you know during detox week you're gonna lose 10 pounds but you get that right back when you start eating all the weight like i lost like like you know i said five pounds during that week and i haven't put any of that back on yet so hopefully we can get another and we've kind of been bad about it because we haven't gone to the gym yet though we've yeah. been eating better but we just have not had time for the gym yeah that's the only thing so, so maybe this these next four weeks we'll be integrating that so we'll probably be getting more results yeah so, we'll um, integrating that. so i'm looking forward to that the diet's going good the house is going good company only thing that hasn't been going good is getting content out to you guys so we apologize for that but we got like i said this uh stonecrest mall vlog that we're headed to right now so that will be going up most likely uh the day after tomorrow when you see this video and then um we got so we got that and then we got an unboxing video of some funny stuff that i got in for an, another video so we're gonna do an unboxing and then we're gonna do another video on this game that me and nikki will be playing very shortly so i'm looking forward to that one very soon because it's gonna be disgusting so yeah i don't know what he got he ordered everything i don't know what he ordered well it is what it is is there anything else So I'm gonna go ahead guys and when I go home, like right after I get we get back home, I'm gonna just edit I'm not even gonna edit this video. I'm just gonna do what I gotta do and drop it because I want you guys this is gonna be uncut and raw. We're gonna do our thug fizzle with this and uh yeah man, leave comments down below on anything like if you said if you know anything like if you wanna uh tell us a good home inspection prices or um anything yeah, what's the value yeah anything almost average okay, that's our biggest thing the main thing here with that the main thing with that whole situation why it's very important right now by the time you see this video we wouldn't already have probably needed to have we I, by tuesday we would have to have had somebody mm -hmm. we have to give the builder our home inspector before we do the pre-drywall walkthrough so we got hey, nicole, this is Minnesota home. Oh, sorry. i'm calling up. nicole we got we got <laughs> We got uh we got I got text the other day by the builder saying hey hey Tony you know um we we uh you should be getting a call any any day now to get your scheduling for your pre are these open or closed? Those just like diesel. Oh yeah, you'll get a call any day now to get your pre um, drywall walkthrough. So we got to hurry up and find out somebody um, ASAP Rocky on that. We just pulled into the gas station and the mall is right there. So. Yeah, guys, thank you for everything. We hope you, you know, we love you guys. Thank you for all the continued love and support. Sorry for the delays. Stay tuned. The mall video will be going up very shortly as well. And uh, all the videos coming soon, man. It's your boy, Tony. And your girl, Nikki. And, uh, yeah. That's it. We out. Peace. Peace. Also, guys, one last thing. 
do y'all like this quality more than our previous videos with the 4k or is it less like i feel like when you see right now i'm shaking i feel like it's less shaky um also i plan on doing a giveaway on this channel very soon i don't know whether or not to just give away shoes as always or something more since this is more than just a sneaker channel it's me and nikki's channel so feel free to leave some ideas down below on that and uh yeah peace